Glenn Stewart is what they call in the biz a horseman. But it hasn't always been like that. In the last 18 years I've been doing clinics and, and uh, demonstrations, but probably in the last four to six years I started doing a lot more demonstrations. Before that I was just doing uh, teaching people horsemanship and whatnot, but then I started getting into uh, more demonstrations and then I started getting into some competitions, doing colt starting competitions and, and um, the Cowboy Up Challenge here at the Stampede. When it comes to horses, it's not as easy as just get on and ride. There's a lot more to it. And Glenn teaches people how to interact with the horse and develop a relationship where the horse will do what you ask of it. Well, I do horsemanship demonstrations. So we got, uh, when you're working with horses, there's four things really, that there's four areas of the horse. You can do freestyle riding, where you ride with nothing on the horse's head or loose reins. Then there's um, concentrated riding, where you'd ride with uh, contact. So those two areas are in the saddle. Then there's two areas on the ground. There's um, uh, online when you got a halter and a lead on a horse. And then there is uh, liberty when you just turn them loose. It truly is remarkable the power that Glenn possesses over these thousand pound animals. And he loves showing people here at the Stampede that with enough training, any horse will obey. A lot of fun to come here, first of all. Um, you do kind of plan for it, or I do. I kind of try to stress out about it all year. <laughs> trying to get ready for it and thinking of all the things. Uh, they, I was asked to come to the Cowboy Up Challenge when it, their first year that it happened. And I've been back every year since and then they got me doing demonstrations here too. But it, uh, yeah, it helps you get out in front of the public, but it helps the horses too to get in front of this big venue and this much people and stuff. Your horses just get a little bit better and get exposed to a little more stuff. Even though his job is difficult and very time consuming, Glenn Stewart couldn't imagine himself doing anything else. I've been very lucky, I've done a lot of jobs in my life, and uh, but this is one I've kept the longest <laughs> and plan on keeping the longest, and uh, it's the funnest. I learn the most, i probably got to work the hardest at it, but, um, but it's definitely the most enjoyable, most rewarding. For Saddle Up, yeehaw, I'm Dan Clovis.